Hey there, scholars. We are now going to fill out this foldable. Um, so from the video, you should have noticed that uh, they did a lab of comparing all the different types of scenarios of what plants need. So um, we're going to draw the observations that we made. And remember, we have indoor and outdoor. So we're going to start with indoor. So cotton indoor uh, from the video. I believe it just kind of sort of barely grew. I know that it wasn't green. Uh, definitely was more of an orange, orangish yellow peach color. Like it's like things grew out of the seed, but um, obviously um, things are not going to be green if like the outdoor sunlight's not there. Um, without air. Now it had soil, but without air. Um, so soil is dark, the dark brown soil that they used. In fact, the darker the soil, we know the healthier it is. And I believe it was like, like a peachish yellow. And it was like the lady in the video was saying, you know, it's like looking for sunlight. It's like trying, it's struggling, trying to find it, but it wasn't like a healthy, um, the healthy green that you want. Um, and then with air, soil, like not feeling uh, trapped. Oh, I'm so sorry. I just realized I goofed. I'm so sorry. So, so sorry. She has it in a different order in the video and I was just copying the pictures. Oh, I'm so upset with myself. Okay, so nothing really grew. Um, I, in fact, I think it even kind of like grew downward. Okay, so it's this one. Right here that um, in the video you see that, you know, even though it has a space to grow because there's no sun, it's just like a dead, it's like dead, dead stems, practically unhealthy stems, I guess you can call it. Um, you know, like, it's kind of like if you don't sleep enough, you get these dark circles in your eyes, or if you're dehydrated, your skin gets really dry. Um, it's, it's kind of like that. Um, it's, they're all getting water, but it's not getting the sunlight that it needs, you know? So, all right. Uh, cotton, but outdoor, I saw a significant difference because it got the sunlight. It was not green, green. Um, but there was, it was a health, it's definitely a healthier green than this. And then with this one, we did soil without air, soil without air. And, uh, I don't think really much happened. I don't, I'm, I think it was just, it just tells you how important the air is. So without the outdoor carbon dioxide or plants need oxygen to come, uh, to grow. Like we need oxygen to breathe. They breathe in, uh, carbon dioxide. And so, um, and they release oxygen. So if there's no carbon dioxide out here that it has access to, it's not going to grow. So, um, there's that. Then here we have soil with air. This is the most beautiful in the video. Hang on, I just want to remove the picture. My question. So this had very healthy stems and the, they had very healthy leaves able to come out and grow. So there you go. All right. Now I think it's clear. Okay. So you should have written predictions. You should have drawn predictions.
And now I want you to write your observations from this. Draw your observations. Um, we're going to fill this part out now. So we have learned plants need air, and that specific air is carbon dioxide. So CO2, that's what like they, like they call it, CO2. It needs sunlight, not fake lamp lights. It needs good, healthy soil. And the last piece is water, which in order for this experiment to work, we had to give all of them water. You can't like deny water. I mean, you could have had a third section and just say, okay, you know, no water. I mean, that, that could have been another experiment we did, but um, yeah. So you are going to now write down your observations and you're going to take a picture of this lab and you're gonna be uploading it on the next uh, page.